Hi guys, welcome to Video Blog. This is Fleen by Night. Um, it's been a while, hasn't it? Um, I um, was using a webcam for my last two videos, and um, because my AC adapter for this camera had gone missing, so I ended up going on eBay and buying a new AC adapter. So I finally got a better working camera. Um, okay, I've been promising April and May's Subsania Industry. I've been wanting to do them. Um, but because I am dealing with a personal issue since April, um, I lost all motivation. My heart wasn't in it. Everything, I just did not care. I just, I couldn't really focus on um, doing videos because this thing has hit me so hard. Um, and um, I was going to take a hiatus from Subsidian Industry, but I found out that uh, the RA of Edward Elric, which she posted her May video, had indicated it was going to be like the last episode um, for now, I guess. Um, because it's the one year mark of Subsidian Industry. So I thought I would take a chance to sort of uh, take a break and deal with what I'm dealing with right now. Um, and hopefully, uh, once it's done and over with, I will come back and do videos again uh, with renewed interest. Um, I will still do the April and May videos. Um, I just won't be doing as much uh, videos after that. Um, okay, so the big question is, will I stop buying anime and manga after I do those videos and while I'm on hiatus? Uh, no, I haven't. Um, I don't plan on stopping uh, buying, you know, anime and manga because I got a lot of titles I want to get. The thing is, the situation um, is causing me to have to pull my belt tighter, uh, in terms of my budget, so, um, hopefully once I get everything resolved, I will probably get more time and money to do so. Um, but once I come back, I will do a big post of what I bought over my hiatus. Okay, um, so I guess that's it. Alright, anime-wise, um, I'm enjoying Tiger and Bunny, I'm enjoying Torco, I'm enjoying, uh, what's it called? Mm, gotta keep me a minute. Blue Exorcist, and then I'm also enjoying, uh, World's uh, or the greatest first love, you know, the spinoff series from Judico Romantica. Um, and I'm also was kind of bummed about, you know, Tokyo Pop closing um, its doors. And I was actually during, I think May, I, I believe, I was trying to buy books that were from Tokyo Pop. Um, because I didn't know if they were going to send them back um, after the thirty, the March or May thirty first deadline, excuse me, or if they were going to keep them on the shelves. And eventually, my bookstore had to send them back because it's, they're going to sell all the remaining stock at a liquidation sale, which kind of sucks for me. Um, <laughs> so um, one example of you know what I was going to try to buy was. They have the entire series of Fruit Basket, um, the complete series, you know, 1 through, I think, volume 22 or 23, and I'm kicking myself I didn't get them sooner because, um, that would have been awesome to have because I love Fruit Baskets and it's such a great story, but hopefully somebody will relicense it because it's such a, you know, popular series, you know, I don't see why no one can't do it, you know, and 
I'm hearing a lot of news about licenses that were previously held by Tokyo Pop that are being grabbed up. One was um, someone had grabbed the license to uh, Great Teacher Onizuka's The Early Years, or I don't know how it was, what it was in Japan, or and then I think it was like the other one, but not Great Teacher Onizuka. Um, and they said that if the sales for those two series are better, are great, then they will look into getting Great Teacher Onizuka, which I really want because. It's been a while since I've read the manga. I've, I just finished watching the anime. But the thing about the manga is that it does, you know, the anime only went so far uh, versus the manga. You have so much. And when I read Great Teacher Onizuka um, at my library, um, there were times in the later editions of the video, of the manga, excuse me, where they tore pick, uh, pages of the manga out, so it was. I felt kind of cheated. So there you go. Um, okay. Uh, I guess that's it for now. All right. So um, from the bottom of my heart, thank you very much for listening. Um, if I decide to do a video after the other videos that you know I've done while I'm on hiatus, I will let you know. Take care. Bye-bye.